tell us about that last singles match. Obviously, it came down to the wire. Um, she was ranked 84th in singles play by the ITA. Just what was going through your head there in the third set? Uh, so I played two times uh, against her already before this match, and I knew before going to the court that it was gonna be a pretty like hard match. Like every point was gonna count, like as the most important point, the point on the match. And the begin the first set was pretty close. We were like all the time kind of tight on the on the score. I lost the first set in the tiebreak, and then I came back on the second. And uh, yeah, both of us were just feeling like really, really tired. But I was, I wanted to do it for Shay, and I'm like, I'm winning today. So I just gave everything I, I had inside to to win this match. So Shayla just said that this is one of the best teams in the conference that you guys just beat. What kind of confidence does this give you guys moving forward and into the tournament? I mean, as you said before, she's a ranked player. Um, I just played also in UNLV, and I I, I won against another ranked player. So. I'm, I'm feeling like more and more confidence throughout the, the season so um, and also as a whole as a team I think we are all playing much better and all player playing more like a team so that's what what gave us a win today I think. So we honored Shayla today as the lone senior. Can you talk about uh, your relationship with her and just how much she means to this team? Yeah, I mean, Shay brought like a lot, a lot of uh, thing, good things for the team. She's a fighter. I know her from like when we were super young from Spain. And when I came here, uh, um, her being on the team was one of the decisions that made me come here. So yeah, uh, we are gonna definitely miss Shay a lot, but I think he, she gave everything for this team. So. Yeah, I'm super happy. So talk about your singles match today. You started off down in the first set and you had to battle back a couple times. Just what did you see out there and what were the emotions playing in your final yeah. singles match? Yeah, at the beginning I was just really nervous because everything happened right before, like all the, what we do before. So I was kind of like, I started really slow and then, um, I don't know, I was like, just play, just in your day, just enjoy. If you win, you win. If you lose, you lose. You will go home and tomorrow is going to be a new day. So, yeah, I just started playing better and she's a really good player. So I'm really happy about winning today. So you're the only senior on the team, so you obviously have a lot of veteran experience. What are you telling the younger players about getting ready for the tournament? Uh, to be honest, I'm just like, you know, we are a team. We are all here we are gonna fight we are never gonna give up that's for sure and that's what i tell them basically we are here i mean we just beat one of the best teams in the conference so you know anything can happen in the conference so we just have to keep working and working hard and good things will happen so a lot of emotions today as you are honored as the only senior um, on the wolf pack so how are you feeling now and how do you want to be remembered in nevada women's tennis uh, I don't know. I just, I'm just really happy to that I came here. Honestly, I enjoyed my four years, even though sometimes it was really getting really hard and hard. But I'm just really happy that Guillaume and the whole university gave me this opportunity coming here from all the way from Spain and not speaking Spanish, not speaking English. Sorry. So I'm just very grateful and. Yeah, <laughs> happy to be here. Why don't you say something? What do you want to say in Spanish for us? <laughs> Gracias por todo.